Lesson 8 Adding Timestamps and Using Agenda Mode The main objectives of this video are learning how to use scheduled and deadline timestamps and to view tasks using Agenda Mode. To start Emacs, double click on the Emacs shortcut on the desktop. Within a few seconds, the program will open. To open a file, Go to the file icon in the menu bar, then select a file dialog window will open. Navigate to the location of the folder that you created earlier to save your org mode files and open the file. At the bottom of the file, there are several sets of tasks. To add a scheduled timestamp, Navigate the cursor to the task, then enter Ctrl-C followed by Ctrl-S. A calendar will appear at the bottom of the screen. Click on the desired date to start work on the task. The keyword scheduled will be added below the task. To add a deadline timestamp, click on the task, then press Ctrl-C followed by Ctrl-D. A calendar will appear. Click on the desired date to complete the task. The word deadline will be added. After adding schedule and deadline timestamps, these can easily be viewed in agenda mode. To set up agenda mode, the file needs to be added to the agenda file list. To add the current file, enter Control C, then press the open square bracket key. Next, go to the Org menu in the menu bar, then select the Agenda command menu item. A list of agenda commands will be shown at the bottom of the screen. Press the A key to view the current week of agenda items. Here you'll see items from two files, Notes and My Notes. To view a larger block of time, Go to the Agenda menu in the menu bar, then select the View menu item, then select from the list of sub-menu items shown below. To close Agenda Mode, go to the Agenda menu in the menu bar and select the Quit menu item. The Agenda menu will be removed from the bottom of the window. You have learned how to use schedule and deadline timestamps and view tasks using Agenda Mode. The next video will show you how to use the Capture feature in Org Mode to capture new tasks easily. To see all the videos in this series, go to orgmodeforbeginners.com.